Na kufikia siku ya Jumatano ambapo tulikuwa hapa shule mwenzetu alinipigia simu akaniambia kwamba ameza kushikwa na ko pale uh, kwa kwa get uh, niki nikinukuu tu maneno aliyoniambia aliniambia my friend i'm here at the gate contained at some room and the security officers they are here but they don't know what they are up to sasa uh, kuanzia wakati ule uh, nikajaribu kumpigia simu haikuingia nimemtafuta nimeenda kule katika kituo cha polisi sijampata nimezunguka hadi nimeenda kule hospitali nimemkosa <laughs> jana nimekuwa hapa shule nimeingia hapo ndani na wanafunzi mmoja chuo kikuu cha Tumo Mbasa ameripotiwa kupotea kwa zaidi ya siku mbili baada ya porukushani iliyosababisha chuo hicho kufungwa. Mwanafunzi huyo alikuwa mmoja wa wale waliokuwa uh, wanawania wadhifa wa uongozi wa wanafunzi katika chuo hicho. Na mtungana naye mwenzetu Francis Mtalaki atufahamishe mengi kuhusiana swinto fahamu hiyo. Rashid siku tatu zilizopita katika chuo hiki cha uh, Tum katika kaunti ya Mombasa kulikuwa na ushaguzi. Uchaguzi ambao ulipelekea purukushani za sintofahamu na ikapelekea uh, chuo hiki kufungwa na siku mbili au tatu baadaye na kufikia siku ya Jumatano uh, ambapo tulikuwa hapa shule mwenzetu alinipigia simu akaniambia kwamba ameza kushikwa na ko pale uh, kwa kwa get uh, niki nikinukuu tu maneno aliyoniambia aliniambia my friend i'm here at the gate contained at some room and the security officers they are here but they don't know what they are up to sasa uh, kuanzia wakati ule uh, nikajaribu kumpigia simu haikuingia nimemtafuta nimeenda kule katika kituo cha polisi sijampata nimezunguka hadi nimeenda kule hospitali nimemkosa <laughs> jana nimekuwa hapa shule nimeingia hapo ndani na, na kufikia siku ya Jumatano uh, ambapo tulikuwa hapa shule mwenzetu alinipigia simu akaniambia kwamba ameza kushikwa na ko pale uh, kwa kwa get uh, niki nikinukuu tu maneno aliyoniambia aliniambia my friend I'm here at the gate contained at some room and the security officers they are here but they don't know what they are up to. Sasa uh, kuanzia wakati ule uh, nikajaribu kumpigia simu haikuingia. Nimemtafuta, nimeenda kule katika kituo cha polisi sijampata. Nimezunguka hadi nimeenda kule hospitali nimemkosa. <laughs> Jana nimekuwa hapa shule nimeingia hapo ndani na chukua maana yake uh, baadhi ya wasimamizi hawapo tayari uh, chuo kilifungwa ilikuwa saa 8 Jumatano lakini hatukujua chanzo cha mbona chuo kilifungwa kwa sababu tulipata tu uh, tu tulipata tu ujumbe kutoka kwa 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 mkuu wa shule mmoja wa wakuu wa shule kwamba chuo kimefungwa na hatujui kitafunguliwa lini sasa tulikuwa tunauliza mbona chuo kifungwe na hatujapewa sababu gani mbona kimefungwa hatujaambiwa mbona twende nyumbani ile hali badala watupatie ile solution of why students lazima wakue shule kwa sababu wakati huu ni wakati mgumu tumeweza kupoteza muda mrefu sana wakati wa corona saa hizi pia ndio hicho kinafungwa wengine wetu nafaa tumalize shule saa tunashangaa mbona shule kifungwe saa hizi mmeenda katika kituo cha polisi wewe kwa upande wako ukianza na majina maafisa wa polisi wanawaambia nini kwa majina naitwa Victor Macharia mwanafunzi katika chuo kikuu cha kiufundi cha Mombasa na tumeenda katika waliomchukua waliomshika wakija wakiulizwa wanasema kuwa wao hawahusiani na hilo jambo na sasa sisi tunajiuliza ni, ni siku gani ambapo mtu ataamka kupigania haki za wanyonge akose kutekwa nyara akose kutishua maisha yake na apiganie haki kwa kusikizwa kwa sababu sasa sisi hatuna lingine la kufanya. Wewe ni mwenzetu katia, katika chuo kikuu. Shule zimefungwa. Wakati zilifungwa, wengine wetu hawajui kwenye wali, wangeenda kuishi. Mbona? Kwa sababu wanalala hapa shule ndani. Ukiangalia watoto wa kike, wengi wao ambao walitolewa wali, wali huku, walila, walilala hapa katika iki kijikioski kwa hapa. Sasa sisi tunajiuliza 
ni mpaka lini ni mpaka lini tutasikizwa ni mpaka lini watetezi wa haki watasikizwa Asante sana hao ni baadhi ya wanafunzi wa chuo hiki cha Tum katika kaunti ya Mombasa wakisema nasi na lala makuu ni kwa wanataka not allow any exercise to go on within the institution before CJ is released and before the nullification of the results that were released on Thursday I want to again state that we will not listen to the DVC and the dean because they are the people who are involved in the malpractices of the results in Tum we will not allow we shall not allow and we cannot allow we ought not to allow that because we, ca we cannot even file a petition to an office that is not responsible of handling our issues on us don't run don't run put it there put it back don't run ja you going beat him up don't run put it back don't run don't run put it back don't run ki jamii ndo ni ya faida nani ani wodo ni ya faida Donald Trump ni ya